Welcome to Taskmaster Creative, where we talk about art, artists, and the process of making art. I'm Kirk Taskola, and today we'll be reviewing the Carl Pencil Sharpener. Be right up. Okay, we're here today to talk about the Angel 5 Pixel Sharpener uh, made by Carl. Uh, I bought this off of Amazon.com. It was moderately priced. It was uh, $18.50. Uh, recommended to me by one of my friends. I forget who it was. Uh, but it comes in three colors. Red, black, and a baby blue. Um, I chose the red, clearly. Uh, and I want to tell you a little bit about this. Um, I'm going to give you the ups and downs to what I found. Uh, it makes a fantastically sharp pointed pencil. Um, I just did this right before I uh, started this video. It is, let's see if you can see it, uh, comes to a really nice sharp point uh, and great for drawing um, and doing that fine detail work you need as an artist. Um, Operates like most of your old school hand crank pencils. Uh, I find it works best if you go clockwise. I think the video is showing it counterclockwise only because it's mirroring my actions. Um, and it has this nice little clear drawer that you can see when it's full. And that's the shavings from my one pencil. Um, it has this nice little holder that will clamp onto your pencil when you are sharpening it, so holds onto it like that. Um, it does come with this little tool that will hold on, inserts right here in the bottom, and will clamp onto your table and you just tighten it up with the wing nut here at the bottom. I do recommend that you do use this to give you that extra leverage that you need. Um, that way you don't have to try to hold onto the pencil pushing it in as well as cranking it. Um, it just gets a little awkward. I have been able to do it, but I kind of have these monstrous huge hands. Um, all right, we... It does have this pull-out if you ever need to get in here for some reason. Um, and when you crank it, it snaps right back in. Um, I did find that you do, on occasion, need to pull out the mechanism and you just rotate this counterclockwise and pop it out um, because on occasion I have had soft leads that have broken off way in the tip in there and the only way I found that I could get it out is by having some sort of sharp needle-like object like uh, this is a little Celtic brooch from one of my costumes and you have to get way in there to dig out that piece. Um, there's no other real way to get in there. So you need some sort of little tool, long pin or something of that nature um, to dig out those soft leads when you break it. It's happened to me a couple of times when I was trying to sharpen um, a chalk pencil and um, on occasion a colored pencil. I've had this sharpener for a couple of weeks now. Um, and I do like the idea that it makes a really sharp, sharp uh, pencil point, and it's really easy to operate um, when you're using that table uh, clamp. Um, 1850, I do recommend it with that one caveat about trying to sharpen soft pencil leads. Uh, aside from that, uh, I think it's a moderate purchase, a moderately priced purchase, uh, well worth your time, and... Uh, Give it your thought. Uh, I'm giving it uh, about three and a half stars uh, out of five. So, uh, yeah, maybe I'll even go up to four. Uh, the, that one caveat, it is annoying, but you can deal with it um, if you have the right tool. Um, they were able to pop out really easy. Um, so, the Angel 5 Artist Pencil Sharpener, uh, I'll have the links for. Uh, where I got it on Amazon.com uh, in the 
information below. If you like this video and you'd like to see more types of art reviews, uh, give me a like, a comment, share with your friends, and uh, give me some feedback, okay? Uh, hope you like it, and uh, have a great week. Bye.